Windcraft currently has eight different tiers of items. Normal, Unique, Rare, Set, Legendary, Fabled, Mythic, and Crafted. While they may not individually be very powerful, set items feature a unique mechanic where if you wear two or more pieces of the set, you gain extra bonuses on top of what the gear would normally provide. These bonuses are unique to each different set and increase relative to the number of pieces you are wearing. In this series, I will be showcasing and analyzing every armor set in Windcraft. This is Set Spotlight. Hello everybody and welcome to episode 22 of Set Spotlight. In this week's episode, we'll be looking at the Water Relic set. This is the last of the six relic sets, and once again, all relic sets are untradeable and are obtained in the same way. Spread throughout the Wind Province, there are several relic guardians. These are neutral mobs that look like a suit of iron armor. When killed, they will turn into a hostile version that carries a diamond sword and replaces one piece of iron armor with a piece of blue leather. The level 25 relic guardian found in the savanna drops the boots. The level 30 relic guardian found in the eastern desert drops the helmet. The level 35 relic guardian found in the mesa drops the chest plate. And lastly, the level 40 relic guardian found in the Nessa forest drops the leggings. The water relic boots require level 25 and 15 intelligence to wear and give plus 130 health, plus 6 water defense, plus 4 intelligence, between plus 1% and plus 5% water damage, and between plus 3% and plus 13% water defense. The water relic helmet requires level 30 and 21 intelligence to wear and gives plus 185 health, plus 12 water defense, plus 5 intelligence, between plus 2% and plus 8% water damage, and between plus 4% and plus 16% water defense. The water relic chest plate requires level 35 and 27 intelligence to wear and gives plus 245 health, plus 18 water defense, plus 7 intelligence, between plus 2% and plus 10% water damage, and between plus 4% and plus 18% water defense. The water relic leggings require level 40 and 42 intelligence to wear and give plus 320 health, plus 24 water defense, plus 8 intelligence, between plus 3% and plus 15% water damage, and between plus 5% and plus 21% water defense. If two pieces of the set are worn, a set bonus of plus 55 health, plus 1 mana regen, plus 10% loot bonus, and plus 5% XP bonus is applied. If three pieces of the set are worn, a set bonus of plus 170 health, plus 2 mana regen, plus 25% loot bonus, and plus 10% XP bonus is applied, and if all four pieces of the set are worn, a set bonus of plus 20 intelligence, plus 360 health, plus 4 mana regen, plus 50% loot bonus, and plus 25% XP bonus is applied. This set is entirely focused around the element of water. To wear the full set, you will need a minimum of 26 intelligence, and if you are at this minimum amount, you'll have to equip the pieces in order from lowest level to highest level in order to wear the full set. When factoring in the intelligence increases from the individual pieces of the set and the set bonus, you are getting getting plus 44 intelligence in total, bringing you up to a minimum of plus 70 intelligence with the full set equipped. This set has less health than every other relic set, and it has the smallest percent increase to your damage, but it more than makes up for this with the intelligence and mana regen provided. This set is meant for mid-leveled players who wish to use a lot of spells, and it does so quite well compared to other gear at your disposal. There are a few armor pieces that would give you more mana regen than this set, but they aren't as easy to obtain, and you miss out on the massive intelligence boost by using them. This set is best on mage or shaman, as mage's heal and shaman's totem heal more the higher your water damage percent is boosted. This is likely the reason why this set has the smallest percent damage increase of all the sets, but I'm not entirely certain on that. With some extra mana regen and spell damage on your accessories and or weapon, this set is quite promising no matter what weapon you are using. So if you love spells, pick this set up. 